Over the last 10 years, the Department of Radiology at the University of Florida College of Medicine has conducted a simulation-based evaluation of radiology resident competence in critical care imaging. 194 residents interpreted this case of pneumatosis intestinalis as one of 65 cases during an eight-hour simulated on-call shift with a median score of one out of 10 and an overall average score of 3.47 out of 10. Overall, the average number of points lost out of 10 to observational discipline was 6.34. At the same time, 0.19 points were lost due to interpretive errors on the part of the residents. We define an effective report to be one which achieves scores between 7 and 10. In terms of letter grades, this would be an A or a B. In this most missed case, 22% of residents produced effective reports. We define a report having a critical error to be one with scores between 0 and 2. In terms of letter grades, this would be an F or a D. In this most missed case, 64% of residents produced reports with critical errors. This is a AP supine abdomen film for abdominal pain. The first thing we notice in the right aspect of the abdomen, we see some linear collections of air as well as some mottled air, which is concerning for pneumatosis and testinalis. We also see another linear collection of air, which does not appear to be along the course of any bowel loops, and this may represent air within Morrison's pouch concerning for pneumoperitoneum. Finally, in the region of the liver, we see some linear collections of air which extend out to the periphery of the liver, and this is concerning portal venous air. So taken together, we have findings that are concerning for infarcted or ischemic bowel, and this is given an acuity ranking of four and an immediate call to the physician or surgical team should be given.